Hello and welcome to Storytime with Pastor Betsy. Today we are going to read the story called Mary Visits Elizabeth. I love this story because even though you know me as Betsy, my real name is Elizabeth and it's fun to read about somebody in the Bible with the same name. We read from the Spark Story Bible. One day, Mary hurried to visit her cousin Elizabeth. She would, had an exciting surprise to share. Elizabeth was going to have a baby, and Mary wanted to tell her that she was going to have a baby too. Hello, Elizabeth, Mary called when she arrived at the house. Are you surprised to see me? Elizabeth stared at Mary with big, wide eyes. She was so excited to see Mary that she didn't know what to say. The sound of Mary's voice even made the baby inside Elizabeth wiggle and squirm for joy. Without even asking, Elizabeth knew the secret Mary wanted to tell her. With tears in her eyes, she hugged Mary warmly and said, Mary, God has blessed you more than any other woman, and God has blessed the baby you will have. Can you guess how I know? As soon as you said hello to me, my own baby wiggled with happiness inside of me. Because you believe God keeps promises, you have been blessed. Mary was so full of joy that her words sounded like a beautiful song. I praise God and I am so happy because of God, my Savior. God has chosen me a simple servant. From now on, all people will know that God has blessed me. God has done something wonderful for me, and God's name is holy. God shows kindness to people who obey God, gives power to the poor, and feeds hungry people. God has helped the people of Israel by keeping the promises made to our ancestor, Abraham, and his family forever. Mary stayed with Elizabeth for three months. They had so much fun getting ready for their babies and talking about what their children might be like when they grew up. When the time came for Mary to leave, she felt sad. She said to Elizabeth, God be with you and your baby until we see each other again. Elizabeth said, God be with you and your baby too, Mary. Soon it was time for Elizabeth to have her baby. She gave birth to a baby boy, a son. Elizabeth's family and friends were very happy for her. God was so good to Elizabeth. And here's a question for you. When you have exciting news to share, how do you tell your family and friends about it? And just as we've done each week, there is a coloring sheet that you can do. And you can find it on our website. This one is about Mary visiting Elizabeth, just like we read in the story. Thanks for join, joining me for story time today.